A word about picture frames. If you want to frame your piece in a mat, it looks wonderful. I, it actually looks very nice and beautiful, and I highly recommend it. So how do you do it? So this one is um, a regular picture frame. You can see because the, the mat is right next to the frame. So there's not a lot of room between your piece and the glass. So for this one, because this was nice and bulky and, and it was really big on the back, it smushed up against the glass and it just didn't look very good because it looked like smushed yarn. So for this one, I just took the glass out completely. I didn't think that it was needed and um, I think it looks really good. With that said, these looked fine. When I framed it, it, these looked fine. So you might be able to, if you have thinner yarn and you do it a top stitch on this side, you might be able to put it in a frame with a glass that's just a regular frame. You just have to try it. If you want the glass and you don't want it to smush, there are these deep set picture frames. So you kind of, I found this one at Hobby Lobby and it was, there was only one. So I don't know how, uh, popular these are. I have been told that um, Ikea has one, but I'm not even sure about that one. So basically if you can see the, the frame, the picture is about a half inch back from the glass. So the picture is on the back of this and then they make, um, there's a little piece of foam or something in there that is making the glass set up outside of the frame. So this is what a deep set frame would look like and you can um, tape, I, all I did was tape that one in there. I just used um, packing tape to tape it to the sides of the mat and then I just put it in the frame. You don't have, it, it was super easy. So you would just um, trace so you could take this out, trace the mat on your monk's, stretch your monk's cloth first, then trace this, the rectangle on the monk's cloth and then do your design. And then once you're done with it, you would um, set it, tape it to the mat and put it into the frame. One piece of advice for the tracing part is that I have, if you can see, I have lines here, my black lines. So if it were me, I would um, trace a little bit outside of the mat so you don't see the line once you put it into the, to the mat. So that is my one piece of advice is watch your line so you don't see it as you're, once it's, it's framed. 